is prologue. Hello, 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 okay, so, alright, hey guys, RJ94 here, I'm going to be doing a tutorial on, um, new dueling system that recently came out in, like, January or so, it's usually, it was made by Chinese developers, but now, um, some team somewhere, thank you, has translated this system into English, and it's called UGO Pro, it's kind of like Dueling Network, except it works much better um, in terms of you don't have to do the rulings, you don't have to subtract life points or anything, it's fully automatic. So, okay, let's get started with this. Um, I'm going to be providing a link in the description, this Mediafire link, so I'll put that in the doobly-doo. So what you got to do is, um, here's a Team Cat chart group it's mainly who this is for okay what you do go to that link I've uploaded this myself because the one I downloaded was um, was like in Russia or something and it took forever to download I don't know if this will take the same amount of time but it shouldn't but if it does I'm sorry there's not much I could do about it it's almost 200 gigs I had to like take out a file the um, Hamachi EXE in here, but it's not that big of a deal. You could go download it yourself. Anywho, yeah, you're gonna download this. Click download right her. I don't really need to do that since I already have it downloaded. Once you have it downloaded, you are going to extract. If Alt Zip will load, you don't need Alt Zip by the way. Um, Windows normal zip handle will take care of that. This thing would just load. We'd be in the business. Today, please. Today. 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 There we go. What you gotta do is extract this to your desktop if you wish, your documents, whatever. Let me just rename my New Jerusalem that's already here New Jerusalem Null extract it that's going to take a couple of seconds it's a lot of files this is the latest version I'll also link a link in the description to the main website so if there are any updates you can download it from there because I only have the latest version at this time which is 10.22 and it's a real step up from all the other ones the effects are great sound effects and you could add your own music and backgrounds you could add your backgrounds before but now what's new to this is you could add um, a background music labeled as song.mp3 and I'll show you how to do that after everything extracts any day now Okay, you know what? Screw that. I already have the folder. Stop the task. Ding. Wow, I'm, I'm really stuck at making videos. Anywho, open up your folder. Mine is Jerusalem, not Jerusalem. So, this is basically what you get anyway. You get the gframe.exe. I renamed it to, um. Yeah, I'm just gonna rename this right now. UG. Oh, pro. You can make a shortcut if you wish. So you could just link it to your desktop. I already did so. So, yeah. What you got here is R, your textures. 
<coughs> these are what show up in the game like if you want a special summon you have two level four monsters or you need to synchro fusion I don't think for fusion because you need to activate um, fusion from your hand so that's the um, activation symbol with the hexagram now it's over your graveyard too attack symbol that should be familiar this is the background that I provided the other one was just some something I think it was galaxy eyes you can change your background I'm sorry if you don't want this but whatever this is for chains this is my custom um seal sleeves seal sleeves whatever um equip symbol rock paper scissors blah 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 negated symbol all that good stuff sound this is where stuff gets a little interesting so of course it's not going to be in here but you have song.mp3 you go to your music folder whatever you want you basically pick a song any song you want um copy it any anyway, you pick a song copy it let's say to your desktop again rename it song what the French toast okay song that mp3 I already have a song on there so it's gonna be labeled to song 2 obviously yours is gonna be song then you just drag it into this folder given that I didn't already upload a song that mp3 if I did it's just gonna override it and that's fine okay so once that's done you have your song you could go on to editing your stuff you could open this in Photoshop down her you could yeah just open it in Photoshop and put a new image over it like um I'll show you right now I'm just getting all the custom stuff out the way so I don't have to hear complaints about oh how do you get custom songs and how do you get um custom backgrounds and card sleeves and stuff like that just getting it out there now then I'll get to the technical stuff with Hamachi and all that good stuff so bear with me loading 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 alright so you got Photoshop started up you don't have to have Photoshop you can have whatever you want paint even Paint.net I would recommend. That's like the second best. Even Windows Paint would be good. Like the newest version. I guess the old version would work too. I'm not sure. Anywho, drag your thing in here. If Photoshop wants to freaking cooperate today. Today, today, today. Fuck. Alright, so yeah, you got your image, right? Then go somewhere else, go on the interwebs. Go to Google, whatever you want. I have a whole brick load of um backgrounds. Hmm. Hopefully this one's in it. Okay, you could use that one. This one that's Hitagi, Saya, it's a ninja. Noel, yay. Um I'm just trying to pick one. That'll be appropriate for the game. Which one? Magician Girl? Magician Girl. Why the hell not? Let's make it DMG. Black Magician Girl. Alright, um, what to pick, what to pick. Ah, for the hell of it, just, I'm gonna pick this one. Should be common knowledge, but whatever. Cleavage. Alright, so, you go there, and resize it over the original image like so. Ooh, this one actually fit pretty nicely. The other ones usually don't fit all the way and you have to 
do a little disorientation, a little stretching. Disorientating. Um, yeah, so then you'd save that as the original. You go to save. Wait, first you'd have to flatten them. And then you'd hit save. And it would show up there, but I'm not going to change mine right now. Or should I? Should I? Should I? Sure, why not? Just for purposes. Maybe I'll keep it. Most likely I'll be changing it back. So, yeah, it's now. Ross. Alright, where'd it go? Where'd it go, damn. Okay, now it's right there. You could do the same thing with the sleeves. I'm not changing it, but it's the same idea. So that basically covers. Oh, fonts. If you want to change the font, I changed mine to this, so if I load it up, Yugi Pro, right now. Um, no songs would be playing because. Wait, there is a smell of a song playing. Turn on my volume. See, your background will be there as shown. And I changed my text. It will be different on yours because obviously I didn't change the text in the, um, the zip. So, yeah, there's your text. Here's my deck, blah, blah, blah. I'm really off subject. So, yeah, that's what your background will look like. It's fine. So, about changing the text. You could go to here, type in font, open that, and your fonts will load. While that's happening, You go to here, go to your settings. Most stuff you want to edit would be. No, 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 I'm not even going to say that. If you want to change your fonts, I only did it for the text. I have not tried it on the numbers font, but I'm guessing we'll just change the numbers as it suggests. Originally, it's going to say something um, like. Yeah, it's going to say Simhei, and that's the Chinese character text thing. So all you do is wait for fonts to load. You could find a font on the internet if you want. But why do that when you have a bunch of fonts already installed on Windows? So what you're going to do, wait for the fonts menu to load, which takes years. And essentially, copy a font you want, Command-C, or Control-C, whatever you're running. I'm guessing Windows, because... Yeah. Mac doesn't. I'm guessing Mac wouldn't work with this unless you had a crossover, but that's a different story. Um, Control C, copy your stuff over, copy your stuff over into here, and then go into settings and rename this one line. Um. Okay, so yeah, copy, copy that into there. X, minimize, X. As for Hamachi, go online, uh, Google, log me in Hamachi. Okay, you go to this. Sorry, my computer is really stupid. Um, go to. Um, pick one of these. I'm guessing download unmanaged. Then after you do that, um, you're gonna need to install it, obviously, and then you need to make an account so you can link it to Hamachi, and that'll probably be ran inside the um inside the installer or after you st install Hamachi. Now, after you get Hamachi,